Hey guys, it's been a while. Um, today I wanted to show you something new that I bought for the van that's very useful. And then uh, also talk about the curtains and put the curtains up uh, and see how they look. And I'm talking about the blackout curtains. So let's get to it. Check out my new toy that I got for Christmas. It's a Black & Decker Dust Buster. Rechargeable, which is gonna come in very handy for the van. Got little attachments. It's got this one, and then it's got this one that you put on the end. So let's test it out. Okay, I'm gonna try to hold this as steady as possible while I'm doing this. And just so you can see, so you see we got some, a little bit of sawdust there. And then we got sawdust in here. And I taped that up just so it wouldn't go down the drain there. So, let's check this out. Pretty powerful. Got all that up. I wanted to show you the brand of curtains that I have here for the van. So this is from Walmart, Eclipse, 100% blackout curtains. Two panels. And it's just long enough to be able to go from the ceiling to the floor. And I'll show you, I'll put them up here. Okay, so I put them up, you can see that it there's a little bit of a gap, but from the outside, you shouldn't be able to see too much light because the, the van kind of dips down in the front there. I'm gonna try to put them a little bit higher. It's just, like I said, it's a challenge because there's not really anywhere to put the bar. You can put it like right there, I, I guess, but there's, I don't think there's a place on the other side. See. It doesn't have the same configuration as the other side, so yeah, it just makes it very challenging. I'll figure something out. It, it does, I admit, it does get on my nerves that there's a gap right there. But, but these curtains are almost perfect. Did you see they got a little bit on the ground, but if I lifted it up a couple inches higher, it would just be perfect. Van life challenges. That looks a little bit better, not too bad. And if it just gets on my nerves too much, I'll, I'll figure out something on that side, because that's, that's the problem side right there. This side's fine. It fits into a little corner right there. But this side, there's just not anywhere to really dig into right there. Right here. This side right here. Is that? And uh, I can still go a little bit higher on the. So that brings it up off the floor a little bit too. And then this right here. I can just put Velcro or something just to put the little sides in. It's pretty much going to block out most of the light. Enough for me. I don't really like a pitch dark in here anyway. Yeah, the curtain makes a great backdrop for 
you know, doing vlogging or playing the guitar. So it's almost like you get different kind of uses out of it, not from just blocking out light for sleeping, but also for doing stuff like that. Not too bad. It's fine for now until, like I said, I figure out something on this side. Yeah, it's getting my nerves, that little gap there. <laughs> yeah. I know it's not going to go perfectly up against here, but at least if I can get it just a little bit higher somehow, then it would be perfect. <laughs> 